In this video, we'll be looking at the different ways you can control a smartphone without touching it. And we won't be talking about the familiar Siri and Google Assistant. Number 1. Voice Access This is an official Google app and it empowers users to interact with their Android phone solely through voice command. First, you download and install the Voice Access app from the Google Play Store. Grant accessibility permission for voice access. Allow phone call permission. Enable always on Google Assistant in the Google app setting. For it to identify all the items on the screen, Voice Access assigns numbers to every clickable element on the screen. For instance, saying 9 might open the camera app, that is, if the camera app is labeled the number 9 on the internet. Open YouTube. Scroll up. Scroll down. And it supports Swipe categories right. that include text composition, navigation, gesture control, and core function. This app is compatible with all phones running Android 5.0 and newer. So to be able to make use of this app seamlessly, Ensure you enable OK Google, Voice Match, and make use of the Pixel Launcher for the full voice access experience. This is likely because the voice access uh, experience is designed and tailored towards the Pixel phone user interface. So it is necessary to set up your Pixel Launcher interface to make it easy for it to match um, features and, and possible buttons. Another method you can use to access and control your smartphone without touching it is by using the touchless control setting. Android devices offer a built-in feature called touchless control. So to activate this setting, go to settings, click on accessibility, voice access, toggle the switch to enable the accessibility plugin for voice access. It works very similar to the OK Google command and this method allows users to perform various tasks without physically touching the screen. This setting is ideal for scenarios where hand-free operation is essential. For iPhone users, you can use the voice control feature and the voice control feature allows you to operate your iPhone without touching it. Although initially designed for users with physical disabilities, it's a powerful tool for anyone seeking a touchless experience. Here's how to set it up. Open settings on your iPhone, navigate to accessibility, look for the voice control option and tap on it. Once that is done, explore the various commands and controls available by saying show numbers. After enabling voice control, you see clickable spots on the screen, each assigned a number. To interact with an app or part of the screen, simply speak the corresponding number out loud. Four. Eight. With this feature, you can pay credit card bills without picking up your device. Use Siri to get your phone's attention, then proceed to get things done hands-free. Of course, that is necessary because um, you need to activate the phone to be able to trigger this action. Now, use commands like scroll up or swipe left to navigate apps and content. Please note that voice control is customizable, allowing you to tailor it to your specific needs. Besides the general control that we have talked about so far, consider these hands-free photography methods. You can capture selfies or regular photos by saying take a picture or take a selfie. Set a reminder for the camera to capture photos automatically. Use accessories like Bluetooth remotes or Apple Watch to trigger the camera shutter without touching the phone. Whether you are paying bills, scrolling through social media or snapping photos, these touchless methods empower you to interact with your smartphone seamlessly. Now if this video was useful to you, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe and let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Remember that all videos going forward will be released to members only before they go out to the general public. So if you want to see my videos immediately after they come out, please join us as a member and it helps the channel out quite a bit and allows us to keep the channel running. Thanks a lot for your support so far and see you in the next video.